Oh, holy sh**, bro. I thought that was it. He, he should have been dead right there. Okay, a little bit of teamwork. We'll go a mile. All right. Well, you stay safe then. Uh, if you want to do that physical therapy at any point, you just let me know. I'll swing back through. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to DOJ. Jumping in here, doing some law enforcement in the Blaine County Sheriff's Charger, the slick top one. We're actually running a different uniform. I use this for LSPD a lot. And I was like, you know what? I got to make this for Sheriff 2. The only thing that I see that needs to be changed is for some reason, my hair color is not brown with highlights. Even though it's not even highlights, it's more like uh, gray hair is what I tried to make it. Um, but nonetheless, that is what we're jumping into today. Going to be kind of like a... I wouldn't really say undercover look, but more tactical unit along with the uh, Sheriff Slick Top Charger as well, too. So let's go ahead and jump into it and see what we can get into. To tango, to tango dispatch. All right, I'm just going to turn Good. around on this guy and make sure he's doing Sounds okay. Driver. It's either a female or a uh, male driver. Send it. It's going to be eastbound hey. Davis Avenue, crosses yeah. Strawberry Avenue. It's going to oh. be 837. On a two-door, right? color BMW um, yes. sedan. Looks like my car. Time you were shaking your bum? Oh, no, sir. I was checking my phone. Oh, checking your I mean, phone. I, I can't really shake my bum for you because I can't stand. I'm too heavy. Okay. But I mean, if you want to come over sometimes, I'm, I'm more than I'm pretty good. I think I'll pass. But is that why you have your little cart here uh, due to your weight? or? Yeah. Is it other reasons? I can't walk. You can't walk. Yeah. Can't walk at all? Well... Why don't we try it? Why don't we see if we can get you to walk right here, right now? Sir, that is very rude. Some physical therapy right here on the side. How's that rude? I'm trying to get you to be more active. I can't, I can't walk. I'm a good, I'm a good motivational trainer and I can assist you along the way. Sir, I'm going to need to hold on to your shoulders. That's fine. Well, I've, it's not, what do you think? Any other cop wouldn't let you do it? Well, they probably wouldn't let you. They probably think no, you're reaching would, for a gun or something. They would take me to jail. They would. Time. How about we give it a chance here? I got I got nothing else going on. I, I don't know. Yeah, wait, you got nothing else going on. You were sitting on the side of the road checking your phone. Well, that's true. That is I true. I might fall and I don't want to get hurt. I don't think you're going to fall. I think I can help you. And if you do get hurt, that's what we have medical for. Bam. That costs too much money. It's not. It, no, let's just check you out. What are your plans today? Nothing much. Just, just chilling, cruising old school. Any wheelies on this thing? Are you making fun of my weight again? No, I'm asking if you can do any wheelies on this thing. I don't know. I haven't tried. How have you not tried? It's a motorized cart. That should have been the first thing you tried. Um, are you just going to keep it on the side of the road? That way we don't have to pick your ass up off the off the roadway. See, I was on the highway. And what? Then... <laughs> yeah. Why the fuck were you the on the highway? Well, I don't have a car. Okay, but if you're going to do that, take Sonora Road. Why the hell would you go on the freeway? That was the only way I knew how to get here. Well, then go down 68 here, and when you get down to the motel, hit a left there on Sonora. Or at least I think it's Sonora that heads to the uh, city there. Yeah, I almost died like 12 times. That's uh, crazy. Though. Yeah, Sonora Road. Next time you're going to go from the city to the county or back, whatever the hell you're going to do, just take Sonora Road. That way you don't get killed. Because I guarantee if anyone would have saw you, they would have pulled your ass over, and you would have oh, had I to sat there. For, oh, well, then there you go. Yeah, he said And they let you go? This. He was going to tow it, but then I told him I can't walk. Okay, so he let you go. Did he give you a ticket? Yeah. Okay. He gave me a ticket for the... Did he tell you where to go besides doing that again, or did he just ticket you and then tell you to leave? He told me to just go on the shoulder. But then How dare he? No, then there's no shoulder on that Yeah, bridge what an idiot. Yeah. Okay, well, now you know what to do, right? Yeah. Okay, a little bit of teamwork. We'll go a mile. All right. Well, you stay safe then. Uh, if you want to do that physical therapy at any point, you just let me know and uh, I'll swing back through. Might have to take your My contact number is 235. That's the department number. So, like I said, if you want to work on it, you let me know and take some time out of my day and we'll get you all squared away. Sounds get you good. walking again. All right, man. Well, you stay safe. You too. Appreciate it. All right. Well. <laughs> That's that's what we call a little bit of uh, community policing right there. I think he thought I was trying to fuck with them, even though I really wasn't trying to fuck with them. I was just I, I, maybe I made one joke where I was trying to fuck with them. Other than that, I was honestly just being like genuine there. Not like I was trying to be an asshole. <laughs> 
We could have we could have dished out a lot more jokes. You gotta love it. All right. Well, nice little community policing. Let's see what else we got. Okay, hey, just got flagged down. Yo, man. Okay, cool. What's up? The old lesson I meant for some bullshit. Uh, what does that mean? Supervisor. Uh, he's lost him for window 10, from my understanding. I am pretty sure that he's not getting arrested for window 10 right now. Oh no, all I know is main stop was for window 10 and he, he said he can't have a supervisor. Okay, well, I can go over there and check and see what's going on, but I can almost guarantee you that it definitely doesn't have to do with window 10. There was probably some other things that sparked up the reason why he's now in custody. Uh, so who are you to the guy over there? I'm his buddy. He was coming to pick up my bike because I got told I couldn't drive it away. Okay. Um, were you just stopped or something? Alrighty. Uh, yeah, I was just stopped. And I, I was the one that had his ID named Ronnie Points. Okay. There was, All right. There's nothing in the truck. Son of a... Hold on. Okay, vehicle fleeing. It's going to be a motorcycle. I'm going to be in the Charger, so... Walkie 24, there's a vehicle high rate of speed. Westbound Route 68. Speed's over 100 miles per hour, and he's failure to yield. Yeah, if I went out there, it'll be a hockey chief drag, red in color, uh, orange in color with a red rider. Okay. Walkie 24, he's slowing down. Are they stupid? Five three five five. Is there a dispatcher coming around? Okay, that stupid ass this fucking AI, there. bro. Monkey twenty four vehicle motorcycles gonna be stopped here. Two seven seven at the gas pumps. One at gunpoint. Can I back the air? Yeah, go ahead and throw it up. Uh, units over there, watch your crossfire if guns are out. I gotta move myself. And if he takes, he's, he's taking off. Subject taking off, uh, 68, going towards Great Ocean Highway. Copy vehicle pursuit. We have 191 attack by a 52 Get Damn, he's gonna be going fast, dude. Thank you. See if I can go in there. Got a trust unit special to get to the two votes. Fuck, this is too far. Fuck, we'll be front end. Fuck, I wish units passed on the left so it was a little safer instead of ducking on the right hand side. There we go. No one's listening to sirens, though, which is getting a little jank. See if I can work. There it is. Oh, God. Dude, he's gonna die if he keeps doing that. Secondary, you need to update. You and five and off, we're uh, gonna be westbound. Uh, Route 68 coming up to the gas station here shortly. You and five and off, the path of wind in a road to westbound. Dispatch needs to know in case someone gets hit off where it's all going down, you know what I mean? You probably want to help us, uh, still westbound passing on gas station. We're going to be, uh, northbound through one. There we go. We're in this bitch, man. We are in it. We're going to get this guy stopped. It's going to be a little difficult with, um, I don't know. He's on a bike and he's getting super dangerous right now. He's gonna probably hit himself off here soon if he's gonna keep going like that. Oh fuck! Holy shit, bro! I thought that was it. He he should have been dead right there. I'm gonna kill my siren since it seems a little redundant to have all these sirens going if we got multiple units in the pursuit. We're gonna have to find a way to stop this guy though. I don't know. If we're gonna have to use spikes or when he slows down, try to taser his ass off. I really don't know, but shit's gonna. Oh my god, bro. As long as he doesn't start shooting, we don't have to escalate this any farther than a vehicle pursuit. Alpha, this, uh, deputy, our, uh, charger one and secondary for speed. Monkey 24, I could go ahead and pass you up. 
Okay, 1Q24 secondary northbound Great Ocean Highway 194. Oh shit. Oh shit. Still continuing GOH. It's going to be 193. Forgot to give a direction of travel there. I don't know how we're going to stop this guy. He's not going super fast. Okay, air units up. Still continuing eastbound Great Ocean Highway 155. Traffic keep it back up at 125. Be careful. 152, they got something up. Gonna be coming up to 152 GOH. You need to the charger, go ahead. I keep that thing up. Eastbound Great Ocean Highway 055, going into Polito. Oh dear. Literally. Oh dear. Go on the left side. There you go. Uh, eastbound Great Ocean Highway 046. Oh, he's ducking, bro. Holy shit. That was close. Uh, still continuing eastbound Great Ocean Highway 061. This guy's getting super reckless. Back right down. You know, you, uh, you're at one, you're three. Control five, Mariner. Okay, we had a major jumble of, uh, I got way too many units in this. You know, will be slowing down at about six miles an hour on the shoulder, route one, zero six six. Lucky 24 to units. Uh, there was five units attached to this prior. I'm not sure where the two or three other units came from. If you, uh, attached without being attached, go ahead and detach from the pursuit. You know, if I do, we'll be coming up with a 24-7. We're at one. You're a fit. Definitely. You're a fit. Hey, we got a 10-50. 10-50, he's down. Oh, my God. That looks horrible. We need to shut down the freeway. Lucky 24, I need HP to shut down the freeway. Okay, there we go. Walkie 24, once the freeway shut down, we'll take the units um, in the westbound lanes, come up and assist at gunpoint. Make sure we're on shout so we can hear. I'm pretty sure he's he's pretty messed up, though. He's on the bike on my side. Yeah, he's he. I don't know what's going on, but it doesn't look good. Yeah, it does not at all. Um, oh, there. Oh, no, he's on the ground over there. One key okay, 24 yeah. to the trooper walking up. You are in crossfire. Major. Major crossfire. Keep Don't going. Crossfire. Okay. If you can hear us on the ground, keep your hands up and just keep them out by your side and do not move. He's probably unconscious, so I say we walk up in formation. We'll just get him in custody. Let's try not to move him too much because he most likely has some pretty bad injuries. Okay, yep. let's do it. All right, let's go. Again, keep your hands out by your side. Let's flip him over again, yeah, Air two five is overhead. Yeah, be gentle with him. Lucky twenty four, we're moving up to secure the subject right now. You got him. Yep, I got it. Not sure was in that duffel bag, but I got it off. Lucky 24, 1015, we're code 4, you can lift the air. Copy 1015, 08, 10 is time, 10 shines, speed 5, 08, 10 is time, 200 to now, this is all, easy, all units, you remember traffic at this time. Lucky 24, if you can roll uh, medical to 068. <laughs> we're gonna get him in bed. Check the choke point, any Okay, yeah, let's grab what we can. Um, let's, uh... Let's get um, eastbound lanes rolling. I think we're good to do that. And let's see here. Yeah, let's just get eastbound lanes rolling for right now. We should be good. I fox right three. You're on his back. I want to try to start. He already is. Yeah. Happy fox right eight three zero. Stand by for contact, mate. Yeah. 
<laughs> okay, somebody else. He's I'm looking, gonna go direct looking a little uh, ran over. I already did. I tried that. Camera, is there two flanks still needed? I got no pulse. Walkie 24, we are secure here. Uh, you're free to go. I appreciate it. Start sleeping on. Copy, Air 25 is going to be uh, headed back down to the city, deactivating. That's taking CPR to a whole new level. Medics. Uh, can I have the injuries of the subject? I'm going to look for any weapons on. Walking 24 Make right sure. now, we're looking at a subject that was hit off his motorcycle. We're assessing the um, subject. We'll let you know in a second. Let's see if we can get a basis on what his injuries are. I'll let medical know. He's got no pulse. He looks pretty, um, pretty rough right now. Copy that. Walking 24 dispatch. Looks like unconscious, not breathing, and no pulse. I don't got any weapons on from the quick path that I just did. Well, at least we got a pursuit. Uh, he was doing he some jank shit, CPR honestly. Through. And I'm surprised that he didn't eat shit a lot sooner. Um, I was expecting him to really fuck his shit up there. He was going, he was like fishtailing, or not fishtailing, he was like bobbing and weaving in and out of traffic. And hey, that's definitely how you get your shit three. fucked up right uh, there. Medicad or Elio Cad? Elio Cad, and I'm activating Medic 3 out of Station 3. I'm, uh, yeah, definitely now. a good little pursuit, though. We were able to get him stopped, Cap and Cap thankfully it was just him that messed his shit up, and no one else had to uh, get hurt or anything like that. So definitely a plus. Um, so that guy that we spoke to earlier then, who was on the... Uh, Scooter, I guess, is in trouble by some sort or whatnot. Uh, we were super cool with him. Uh, looks like this is his scene here at the motel. I think there's already multiple units on scene. Why do I see him running? I don't know what's going on there. It looks like I see some hands up or whatnot, but I really don't know what it is. This is a guy, you know what? Oh my god, there's a traffic stop down there, too. We're just going to see what's going on. They uh, called me out to the... Well, I don't think it was this one. They called me out to another one, actually, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, that's the same guy we spoke to earlier. Walkie 24 dispatch. You can show me 297. I spoke with this gentleman earlier. Catch you right. I didn't see it. All right, are you sure? Is that why I see the case of beer in your basket? <laughs> he does. There it is, dude. You see a so case of beer in the basket. It, Slick, man. dog. Oh, you, ma you match the exact description I got from the local clerk over there. Code 223 is that. And you, you have the it. case of beer. It was an apology, dude. Oh, he apology, called, yeah. He called me fat like 13 times. Who? Cool. To the store and I took it as an apology gift. An apology gift. That's the first time I've heard that. Good. I didn't see it. Yes, sir. You can show the tow request on Los Angeles Freeway I, I across the driver. I could for all units back to it. I'll be deactivating his tow uh, back to me. It is 2 tango 2 2 3. So, what's going on here? So, I went into 24 7 and the clerk started calling me names. So, I took a case of beer as an apology gift. Ocean 2 1 control. Okay. Rob Ping, which was $12 worth of beer. You think it's appropriate to steal uh, even right. though. Just because you know, someone might have called you names? I mean, I, I, you know, I took it as an apology. You know, he's just giving it to me for free on the house. Okay, well, unless he physically says that or actually hands it to you, that's not how it works. All right, sir, do you have any idea on you? Uh, yeah. All right, Mr. Brown, I'll be back with you. How did you go from sitting on the side of the road, super chill, to then stealing beer? He, he was being mean, man. I'm kind of insecure about it. I'm already on a scooter for it. You know? Okay, well, if you're going to step out in the world, you got to understand that you're going to be seen, right? I mean, yeah. Okay, I mean, there's not much you can do about that. The only thing you could do is focus on yourself. So, the guy hasn't drank any of the beer yet, which is good, which means we could return it. Right, Mr. Brown. But it depends on what you. the main guy want wants to do. Oh, they don't want to press charges, so he lucked out. You to come back and pay. Are you willing to go up back and pay? Um, not really. You can just have it back. I don't really want to go back there. I don't want to look at him. Alright. Since you don't have no record, nothing. And it's just $12. He's I'm lucky. Myself. 
as it's just twelve dollars. Not even worth going to jail over. Yeah, jail would be kind of tough for me. I don't know how that would work. Okay, I don't understand like why he gets a break bro. even though he stole know. something and he gets told to take it back over to where it's at, but he doesn't right, take it back to where it's it supposed to go. To go. It's still uh, beer. It's like you no, take your happy ass really. back and you return the damn beer and take it for what it's worth. You know what I mean? So, uh, what am I supposed to do now? All right, Trooper, you want to talk about him not stopping for you? Or... No, it doesn't matter because if it was me, I'd have you take that beer back yourself so you learn the lesson to never do it again. You should have the embarrassment of bringing back a product you stole. Not an officer who didn't do anything wrong. Honestly, I feel like you'd make me walk back. I wouldn't make you walk back. I would take. I would make you. We would escort you and ha you have you take it back and give it back to the person you stole it from. They're they're able to do what they want. If he if he wants to take it back, that's fine. I'm just saying I would make you take the full on embarrassment for this because you were the one that made the choice, right? Yeah. So you the, you should be the one that learns to not do it again. And if you do get caught, you got to take it back and you got to hand it to him and tell him, you know, because you could be going to jail for this. You know what I mean? And if you want to add on what this other trooper was talking about, you didn't stop uh, immediately, if I'm picking that up. Yeah. Which, that that is a whole concoction right there of things that make me go, what the fuck? Especially since we spoke earlier and everything was totally cool, you know what I mean? Yeah, I guess. Okay, so I'm glad you understand, and maybe I think a, a speaking to like this will get you to not take someone else's product like this. And if you do, you better be ready to take it back yourself. I'll think about it. Oh, it's not something that you'd have a thought. It's either you would or you would not. And if not, we got plenty of room in the back of our cruisers. We'll make it happen. It would be a challenge, but we're down for the challenge. Oh, well, I'm good. I think you understand what you've done. And I swear to God, I better not hear you do it again today. All right, Mr. Brown, there's your info back. Yeah. What a, only imagine if that clerk had a shotgun. Oof. Hold on, real quick, though. How You told me you didn't walk earlier. How'd you go and get the beer and, and go up and take it if you didn't walk? I took this inside. You took it inside. Sure if I can try. Yeah. So you drove by, stole beer. Yeah, I did a drive-by. How I dare you? Sounds kind of sick. <laughs> well, I guess there's a first time for anything. You better keep this yeah, damn contraption you have, sir, on the right path. What is that supposed to mean? Oh, means you shouldn't exactly. be using it to commit your crimes. That's what the fuck it means. Well, people use vehicles to commit crimes. Yeah, but well, do we want them to? Not usually. No. So do I, I mean, want to see a man committing robberies on a scooter? No, definitely not. Right, that sounds really fucked up. That, you it does, it? and you're the one portraying it. All right, I'm good here. So you have a fantastic day. I think you're free to go now. Right. Hey, Trooper, am I free to go? Yeah, you're free, guys, sir. Oh, a 33 no, request down here at 125. Adios. Here Have a good day. Stay safe, man. Watch out. Watch out. Someone will die. It always happens. Those are a blast and a half, though, I got to admit. <laughs> you try one out? Oh, they're so much fun. All right, good stuff. So he got cut a break. I was trying to explain to him as he got cut a big break. If that was me, I would have made him go back and give it to him. Uh, himself and not have not have taken it back because it kind of defeats the purpose of someone learning the lesson if they're just like all right here we'll take the beer and bring it back for you don't do it again he didn't get a ticket he got a talking to technically but it, it really didn't progress any farther than that which i'm a little surprised so he must have caught two really chill cops uh because they weren't really trying to do anything which again that's on them if they feel at, at the discretion um of them and what they want to do and all that fun stuff so we're going to be code four here. Um, I really, oh, actually, I was attached to this call, so let me, oh, nope, I wasn't even attached, so we're good. All chilling. Back 10-8, and we're ready to go. Okay, so I was just stopped here to make sure everything was good, and it looks like an unroadworthy vehicle went past, and it was a highway patrol. Uh, we're just going to see if we can back them up here. Whoa. I love how traffic's just spawning in the middle of nowhere. Oh my god, dude. I have not seen anything like that before, bro. <laughs> it looks kind of dope. Oh, it's a union unit? Okay, then they might be good. So I might not even... 263 eastbound 68. 
on a uh, two-door vehicle. I have a 32. If you can advise. One King 24. Yeah, how's it going? They're stopped. They've got no uh, no tail lights. Yeah, I was kind of just curious <laughs> of what it looked like, so I wanted to stop and see, to be truthfully honest. Yeah, no rear bumper. The tail lights are gone. Uh, so I'm just gonna have a conversation with him. I kind of uh, like it though, but yeah, I'm down. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Alrighty. Hey, that thing is so sweet, uh, though. Not gonna hey, lie, bro. I want one. Like... I want one so oh, bad. Have no tail lights. Yeah, tail lights. Got your <laughs> bumper. Right. I mean, I don't know what's going on with the vehicle. It, as my partner, it's like kind of cool. It's cool, but it, it's uh, it's a project. Some equipment. Yeah, yeah it's, it's missing a lot of equipment, but it's already been. It's you definitely dope. For financial responsibility. I want one. Did you just say financial responsibility? Insurance. That. Well, I know, but like. That's the first time I've heard anyone say that. Well, there's a first time for sometimes. everything, bro. But I mean, sometimes. You know, whatever floats your boat. Alrighty, man. Where are you headed? Just down. Where isn't he headed? Larry's uh, RVs. Alrighty. Are you just cruising with the vehicle or, uh. Well, I was going to sell it. Another? So you were going to sell it? Yeah. Alrighty, Kinda I'll be back with it. you. What was that? Kind of done with it. There's nothing else I can do to it. I'm kind of yeah. curious about yeah. what it is, though. Yeah. I've I've never seen it before. Suggestion. They don't. With the parts I have, it doesn't come with their lights. Okay. Is it registered? Yeah, there's a plate. Okay. I know, I, but is it? Is it yeah, just because there's a plate doesn't uh, mean it's registered. But all right. Okay. okay, I'll be back with you in just a moment. Okay. Yep. Uh, you got anything you want to talk to him about, or can I speak to him? Uh, you're going to talk to him. Okay. How's it going? What's up? What is this? Good question. What's it's the base? It's called a what? It's called a weevil. A weevil? Yeah. Uh, Like W-E-E-V-E-L? I-L. I-L. We've, okay. Interesting. And yeah, it, I don't know. It, so you bought it like this, or does it come normal, and then you kind of change it around, or... It's it's a beetle. And okay. I I did all this to it. All right. So you I I heard correctly over his shoulder you said you're selling it. Yeah. Okay. Well, if that deal falls through, hit me up. Um, I think I might know someone who would be interested in buying it. Maybe they can make it street legal again. Have you tried to make it street legal? Nope. You haven't tried. Well, I tried buying some tail lights for it. But, uh huh. You know they didn't really fit right. So oh, some aftermarket ones that weren't legit. I mean, see, then then the engine's not exposed, and it just doesn't look as cool. Well, I definitely think it looks cool, but you could you could see our issue with it, right? Oh yeah. Okay. Um, well, if the deal goes through, good luck. If not, I'll hand you my business card here, and uh, you can hit me up because I think I might know someone who's interested if you are selling it. So that doesn't mean you might not get any tickets from this guy, but. I mean, whoever you know, how much do you want to pay? That's the real question. You know? uh, I'm, I mean, I'm not sure. I, you know, like I said, um, I'll have to get contact information. Maybe I can get you in contact with them. Uh, here, if you want to take this, go ahead. Number is uh, 258 on the back there. There you go. I mean, I'm pretty easy to find. So, I, mean, I, I can see that. My name is Benny B. Benny B. Okay. Well, I appreciate you having a chat with me. Um, I'll let these troopers finish up what they got to finish up then, all right? All right. All right, have a good day, sir. All right, guys. You have a good one. Appreciate it. You have it. a good one as well. You have a good day, trooper. You as well. Appreciate it. Yep. Definitely a cool car. I, I want to do something in that. And I was talking about Don. Don, I feel like, totally needs like a mess around car like that. Oh, my God, dude. I was not expecting to see that when I rolled up to it. It's kind of legit. Okay, that's dope. Not going to lie. It looks like the helicopter is doing a landing, so that way they can get this guy picked up out of here. We rolled back the drivers a little too, and it seemed to make everything so much more stable on the system. So I'm super happy that I can kind of get in here and just play, get in pursuits and all that fun stuff, and not really have anything uh, worry. I don't know if that's going to replicate the same results when I play other times, but at least we got this one. So thank you all so much for coming out and watching this episode of DOJRP, and we will see you next video.
We'll be right back.